Hey guys, welcome to Sword of Mana. Now, this is a remake of Final Fantasy Adventure, also known as Seeker Densetsu 1, and the prequel to Secret of Mana on Super Nintendo. This would, game would later be remade again as, um, Adventure of Mana. But, um,. We're going to play this one. Alright. Yes. The stream again. Oh, don't make me watch it again. In the beginning, the world was void. Then the goddess appeared. In her left hand she held the light of hope, in her right the sword of mana. The goddess summoned spirits to assist in the creation of life. Finally, to maintain peace, the goddess cast away the sacred sword. It is said the sword rusted the moment it left her hand. The goddess then transformed herself into a great tree that would sustain and watch over the world. Mystical power guards the sanctuary where this tree stands to this day. Whoa, what a sun. I could practically see the mana tree. Is that so? Your voice is so unusual, it's like I'm dreaming. Thanks for your praise. Your words are magic, and a great encouragement. Magic, you say? Not at all. I'd rather hear you tell me your story. How about the Geminites? How about how the Geminites defeated the evil Vandal Empire? Unfortunately, I cannot sing songs about myself. Why not? I want to know the truth. Other minstrels just sing about stuff they've heard from other people. They get the story all wrong. <laughs> a story's just a story. No matter the truth, no matter who tells it, it's still a story. Then I'll sing your story. Oh, I just remembered. We have a loot at home. I'll go get it. Such a good-natured child. You should get home. Console might be angry if you dawdle. Dad won't mind. Dad won't be mad. Today's my singing lesson with Lord Grands. Wow, I heard that Lord Grands quit singing after he lost his loot. Nuh uh. <laughs> Lord Grands hasn't quit singing. Break it down. But Dark Lord. This is Grand's Realm Console Herman's estate. So what? Because he's console, we should allow him to harbor heretics. Heretics in my house. Did something happen to Mom and Dad? Most certainly not. But Sir Herman is a friend of Lord Grand's. To suddenly barge in with soldiers seems unthinkable. Anything else to say? Sir, are you telling me to step aside? At the very least, let us get Lord Grand's permission. It's thanks to him we enjoy peace now. Leave if you object. I have my ways. And that's that. Oh no. I've got to tell Dad right away. Hey, I told you not to come in that way. We have guests. Dad, big trouble. We're surrounded by soldiers. What? Prince Shroud, what is all this about? You will refer to me as Dark Lord. As a servant of the realm, surely you know the consequences of harboring heretics. 
Herman, it's just as I told you. This masked man is the one who burned down Manor Village. This man is insane. Now, Prince Shroud, I mean Dark Lord, surely there must be... This can't be true. Heretics. I vividly remember how Vandal used them to pull the wool over the eyes of the entire nation. I won't allow you pr to protect them. Of course not. I'm not one to protect subversives. If things are as you say... That grants he's not a real man. How does one raise such a foolish son? <laughs> That's enough of that. If you got something to say, let your sword do the talking. There must be some mistake, Dark Lord. Put down your sword, please. Out of my way. The idea that the Mana Clan is heretics, are heretics, is simply laughable. I don't know what excuses you'll make, but your sins are severe. I'll make you pay. Pay? You're the one who'll pay, Bogard. What? Knowing all you do, you still play the hero. I'll show you. I'll show you the truth. Traitor! Protect the Dark Lord! Run, Herman! Herman, what is happening? I don't know. Prince Shroudman mentioned something about the Mana Clan being heretics. I have no idea. The heretic girl is here. Go get her. Go out back. Take shade on the girl. Don't let anyone see you. Yes. I'll have no choice. I'll take you. Mother? No, don't leave me. <laughs> Wake up, you must flee now! <laughs> what? What's wrong? Where's Sir Burgard? No time to explain. Take her with you. Go! Who is she? What's going on? Keep quiet. Just get going. I'll deal with them. Open up. One moment, please. I'm dressing for bed. Go quickly. But ma'am! No, I won't. You come too. You're a big boy. Take care of her. I'll try. Don't worry about your father and me. Prince Shroud is such a nice man. I'll tell you all about it later. I'm pretty sure Prince Shroud is a dick. Oh no. Not this dream again. Don't make me watch. Oh. Well, that was weird. Whoa! Whoa! What's up with you shouting like a banshee? Once I was having a pretty sweet dream until you interrupted. Uh. Hey, what kind of dream were you having? Wanna tell me what it means? Yeah, sure. Right. Were you eating a rat bite? Or maybe a mushroom? I hear they're a lot tastier than you might think. Girl. A chick? Whoa. Same one as before? I couldn't protect her. I... Only I was left. After that, she... Aw, oh, get real, will ya? It wasn't your fault. Times are tough. A kid like you couldn't protect her. What could you do? Her name was...
don't know what to call her. There we go, that'll do. Tara. Ow. Itch. No, no, no. Can't be. After we're out of here, you can tell me the whole story. In detail. For now, just hold that thought. Huh? Hey, is that bread? Ha! I got extra. And it's primo stuff. That chick, I hope she's alive. I mean, I'm sure she's alive, no doubt about it. Alright, eat up. We're still alive too. You wanna see that girl again, right? I'm getting pretty interested in her too. See that chick again? You're not still thinking about escaping, are ya? Ha! <laughs> I'm serious this time. One of the soldiers told me. Your last escape plan was an absolute disaster. Another escape plan, huh? Oh yeah. Seems there's a way out through the monster's holding cell. He's pulling your leg. Last time they even punished us with no food for a week. The guy's legit, I swear. You believe the guy because he gave you bread? No, it's not that. His song. Song? He sang this sad song. Lord Grand's songs were always pretty sad too. That's it. Lord Grand's turned into a soldier to help us. Pfft, you wish. Trust me, the goddess loves me. <laughs> the goddess, huh? The guy's legit. <laughs> Don't listen to that windbag, Willy. Beat monsters, show the crowd the beauty and agony of pain. Go on living. Even if you could escape, it's hell outside. You guys planning to break out? Don't make me laugh. I will pray to the man I got us. Whoa. I can obviously see that I've played this game before. But, this is a different one. Don't listen, don't listen, don't listen. You can get the Mana Goddess's protection by praying at the statue. And it's a good idea to get her protection whenever you can. But don't let the Realm Soldiers see you. So that makes you a heretic, apparently. It's almost time. Realm monster bouts are about to begin, but first, a word from our leader. Welcome, Dark Lord. Beloved citizens, your daily struggles are appreciated. Heretics still prowl outside the towns, but have no fear. Is he talking about the Mana Clan? If that's what they are, let's get him. After all, they control mana power, right? Pretending to be weak, they're just like the Emperor of Andor. We advance ever onwards to victory. Our victory led by our own strength. Are we not more powerful than those who rely on the Mana Goddess's strength? Without any effort, not breaking a sweat, wanting only glory for themselves, will people such as this be victorious? What we need is not Mana Power. The Emperor of Andor was manipulated by Mana Power and was destroyed. Let us not make the same mistake. We must be of strong mind and heart. Strong mind and heart! Woo! There are rivals. Dark Lord rules! Tales of the, of the three Geminites from the Dark Age of the Empire are old news now. Do not rely on legends. We must shape our own fate by our own hand. We shall not lose. The victory is ours for the taking. Long live Dark Lord! Woo! Long live Grand's Realm! There are rivals! Well, they're fired up. Willie, Shade, you're up. It's about time. Later, Amanda. Thanks for the bread. Are you going to go through with it? 
You bet. Let's do it. Right. Release the jackal. Now fight. Well, he's angry looking. Ah! That's my sword button. Ah! Ah, fuck! Not a good idea. Neither was that. Ow. Come on, charge down. Back it up. Well, I guess I smashed him. <laughs> Here are your winners, Willie and Shade. Now's the time. Play it cool and smile at the crowd. Gotcha. Long live the Dark Lord. Under a really big rock. Long live Grand's Realm. Under new management. Long live the Dark Lord. Long live Grand's Realm. Fail. did it. We're really gonna get out of here. Mana, Goddess, and Grands, hats off to you. We're free! We can go anywhere. We can do anything! We can eat till we hurl! What do you want to do? I want to get Dark Lord. <laughs> okay, no comment here. By the way, about that girl, Terra, I know that name too. You do? Yeah, but I'm not sure whether it's the same person you're talking about. Or the girl I used to know or not. No use getting all serious here. Okay, yeah, that's it. Let's go to Topple. They have lots of mana believers, so we can talk there. Okay, we're off to Topple. You made it this far. Not bad. What? Dark Lord? Oh, we just wanted some fresh air. Out with the bad air, in with the good. And that'll do me. What do you say we head back? When's our next bout? Dark Lord. Good fighting skills. Smart enough to escape. Too bad you're slaves. How about it, you two? Why not work for me? We're short on heretic hunters. Well, I, uh... What's the matter, boy? Jackal got your tongue. Work for you? You murdered my father and mother, and Terra too. Murdered? What do you mean? The law is the law. Even the laws I made are out of my hands. They've been set into motion, there's no point in belly aching to me. Hey, play along. What do you want, Willy? Go be a ramp, a realm soldier, but count me out. The lawless prefer the sword, of the sword to the law. I can play it that way too, come on. This is for your, for my parents, say your prayers. He stopped the sword with one hand. What the, what are you? Pride comes before a fall, foolish fencer. Wrecked. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, Shade, Shade! Man, I gotta save him! Break his fall! Nicola. Ho ho, we've got a big one. And it's a biggie. It'll be a feast tonight. Not tonight, buddy. Huh? Not remotely fishy. Not even edible. Hmm, as I recall, Grandpappy always told me that being a good Samaritan was good for business. Hey. You. Mm hmm? 
Ow, where am I? Oh yeah, I got knocked off the bridge by Dark Lord. Blast it all. And what happened to Willy? Were you the one that rescued me? My name's Jade. Thanks for saving me. I really appreciate it. That's right. I saved your life. I'm Niccolo, the traveling merchant. What the heck is this? Truth is, I just got here myself. If you ask me where we are, all I can say is we're here. I'm trying to get to Topple. Do you know it? I've heard of it. Really? Which way is it? Beats me. I told you, I just got here. Pay attention, will you? Well, I'm going home. Don't worry, I'll make sure you pay me back sometime. What a fucking douche! Screw that guy. Uh, do I get my sword back or what? Um. Eek! Someone's in trouble. Look out! Ow. Are you okay? Are you hurt? No, I'm fine, thank you very much. I'll just be on my way. It's too dangerous to go by yourself. I can take you where you need to go. No, really, I'm okay. I can get back home on my own. But what if you get ambushed by another monster again? You! You're from Grand's Realm, aren't you? Do I look like I'm from Grand's Realm? Wait, what's that sound? Oh, I'm alright. Oh, alright. If you could take me back to Topple. Topple? Great. I was looking for it myself. We can go together. Okay. Topple Village is northeast of here. My name's Shade. What's yours? I'm Terra. Nice to meet you. Terra. Same name as... No, it can't be. I'm afraid it is, buddy. Terra joins you. Oh wait, a boy from a village asked me for a favor. He lost his book in this meadow. Will you help me look for it with him? Sure. Oh, you can cut grass with your sword. I think we'll find it easy that way. Hmm. Alright. Persian Percy, goddamn. That's one the stupid book. And we're gonna save it. Fuck these blink weeds, why do they take so long on the screen? What's this damn book? Man, that stays up on the screen for way too long. Still, anything is better than fucking Skyward Sword. There it is, got it. Yay! Oh, we got a bunch of stupid stink blink weeds as well. But I think that's enough for this episode, so we're gonna call that the first episode of Sword of Mana. So, if you like what you saw, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time in the next episode of Sword of Mana.